Hello everyone, it's Dexon here. In this training tutorial, we are going to learn one of the most important kick in Kung Fu called Flying Kick, Teng Kung Pai Diao. We are going to learn how to do this kick properly with our foot straight first. And then we can try to snap, push, and set the kick. All right? So before we start our training, please make sure you already warm up properly, all right? First, we're gonna start with kick. I face to this direction so you can see, left hand, slap your right hand, as ready action, left leg up front, all right? We are gonna kick with our right leg first. Left hand, slap your right hand above your head, your right leg kick with your foot straight. Okay, for the street. And ba. So the reading you use your hand to slap your foot is trying to make your leg, make your kick become powerful. Also to encourage you to kick higher. Alright? Slowly. I'll be back so you can see clearly. We do it in slow motion. Okay, now let's try kick a bit faster. And we're trying to chop our leg down faster as well. So, ready? One, two, three, four. So, from the sound, your hand slap your foot, the sound, you can tell your kick is powerful or not, alright? So if you cannot make a sound yet, so please practice more so you can have a powerful kick. So next, we're going to work on the jump. <coughs> I face to that direction first. We do it in slow motion. Left leg up front, as ready action. Right leg, we take one step. Your right leg bend your knee to so this. The height comes from this leg, height. So you can jump up. Okay, jump up. So in this training tutorial, I'm going to use with my right leg. So once you get used to it, you can try with your left leg as well. Use the same method. Okay, one more time. Ready? Bend your knee and jump straight up. You can jump further as well, but in this training tutorial, we're trying to jump up. Up. So use your arms to lead you as well. To that direction. Left leg up front as radiation. One step, take one step, jump. Okay, you can take as many steps as you want. Okay, once you get used to it. So we do one step in this tutorial. Alright? Okay, let's do a bit faster. Okay, next one we add or slap kick. Slow motion first. Ready, step, arms up above your head. Slip, jump, kick, open your wings. Okay, when you finish, open your wings. So, face to this direction, you can see. Bend your knees, and you can jump. Open your wings. Alright, let's do a bit faster. See? 
So if you want to kick higher, you can put your hands a bit higher. Use your foot, trying to reach your hand. Okay? So lay down, we can try with the kicking pad. If you want to kick something, you don't use your hands, slap your foot anymore. You just do the kick. So lay down, we try with the kicking pad. Next, we are going to work on snap kick. So before was our foot straight, now we try to snap. Okay? Face to this direction with a slow motion first, everyone. Take one step. It's the same method. You jump, it's the same. But here, you snap. Pa. You can put your right hand in front so you can snap your right hand. And finish like this. Okay, again. Slow motion. Why? Okay, let's do a bit faster. You can put your hands a bit higher if you like. For beginners, you can put your hands a bit lower. It will be easier to kick gradually. You get used to your coordination. You can jump higher, you can put your hands a bit higher. Let's do a bit faster. One more time with this kick. All right. Next, push kick. Level leg up. Before, before was snap. Snap kick with, with our foot straight. Next one is push. We're trying to hook our foot. Trying to push okay and we don't slap our foot anymore from here in slow motion jump push okay ha. a bit power Lucky last, after we we done the lucky last, we can try how to use those kicks with the kicking pad. Alright? Also you can try with the kicking bag as well. Now lucky last is the same jump. Is you jump, but it turns steadily, become steady kick. Become steady kick. See? We just jump and turn our body. To the side way, if you're gonna kick with your right leg, pa, side kick. Jump, side kick. Okay, let's try how to use those kicks to kick something. So first one is flying kick with a foot straight. So if you're trying to kick something that is higher than you, you can use the first kick. So you can kick higher. Let's have a look. I hope you can see clearly. So this knee is higher than me. See, that's very high. I will use the flying kick with my leg straight so I can reach that high. Let's have a look. You 
see that? You can add more steps if you like. You can kick it even higher. All right. Now let's try with our flying kick for the straight with the kicking pad. I just threw this pad in the air and I kick with this pad with my foot straight. The pad was flying over to our next neighbor. Okay. Let's not. Let's try not kick that high, okay? The next one, we're going to work on the snip kick. I don't want to use too much power, otherwise the pads will fly over again, all right? It will be easier to kick something that is attached, have a string, like uh, kicking with the leaves, or hung your hang your pads in the air or kicking back. Okay, next one is called flying push kick. We're trying to push this pad back. Let's do it together. Push out. Flying steady kick is the same as flying push kick. Just turn your body steadily. This kick is this kick is powerful as well. Let's have a look. Alright everyone, I hope you enjoyed this training tutorial. Remember, practice makes better and perfect. Happy training, happy life. We'll see you next time.